So I'm going to attempt to grow the Carolina Reaper, the hottest pepper in the world as of current. I got these pepper seeds from Pepper North. It's going to be winter here, so uh, I've germinated them inside and I'm going to try to grow them over the winter and with a, with a light and time lapsing it too and see how it comes out. So um, we'll see you in a couple months I guess. But uh, before that, I germinated the seeds over here using um, the top of the boiler because it's the warmest spot that is consistent. So I got it on top of my hot water boiler and they're uh, starting to germinate. So I'm going to plant them now. Okay, got them out of the package here. Let's just, I did the paper towel method. Soaked them in paper towel, put them in a Ziploc bag. And there they are here. Next I'm going to plant them and then uh, transfer them over to transfer them over to some soil and let them grow. So yeah, these look okay. There's a few uh, few germinated, had pretty good success rate. This guy here looks the healthiest, so I'll probably put this in the biggest pot that I'll be time lapsing. All right, so what I've done is I've cut out the paper towel so that way it wouldn't damage the roots and then I'm gonna transfer it over to my pot of soil with my light and start growing. This is probably the longest video I've ever done. I've been time-lapsing the growing of this Carolina Reaper pepper plant for uh, five months so far, um, but it's starting to flower. So I got some flowers going on right here. Check that out. That's pretty sweet. Just growing it all off of this one light bulb, one daytime LED 9 watt light bulb, and it's done really, really well. I am surprised at how well it's been doing. I got my GoPro here, I'm time-lapsing the whole thing, and I'm gonna pollinate it now using a Q-tip, and I'm just going to take some of the pollen from one flower to the other one and just kind of move it back and forth. Um, just hopefully I can get some viable fruit out of this. All right, so it's been about a month since I've pollinated this plant, uh, or attempted to pollinate, but unfortunately, there are no flowers left on the plant. It was unsuccessful. For whatever reason, the pollination didn't take. Um, I had so many flowers on this, but at the time, I had to hand pollinate this because it was too cold outside to put it outside for it to grow and to see if any bees would come pollinate because there were no bees around at the time because it was just far too cold. Uh, so it didn't take. Uh, it is getting nicer out now. Um, still frost at night at, at times. So I'm going to put this out in a few weeks and hopefully it'll reflower according to uh, what I've read and a friend of mine who grows plants. Uh, this should reflower. Um, and I'll repost another video if I'm able to get any viable fruit off this. This was a really fun video to do, really challenging at the same time because there's just so many files that I ended up with um, after time lapsing this plant. So that is it. I'm going to call this video done 
for now. All right, thanks for watching. Until next time, bye.